Oh, what is going on guys welcome back to another video in today's video i'm going to be showing you the best exotic engram prime engram farm in destiny 2 season of the plunder first step go to the moon now i'm going to cover this method um it works for some people and if you are on pc just a little bit of a warning you're going to get a massive frame drop while doing this because of the altar sorrow event i wish that event would just stop frame rates are so bad right now but anyways um let's get right into it so I would like to say for starters, if you guys head over right here down to this little cave area, for starters, you can come right here. Now usually you're going to see a nightmare, like a big red blob right here. Sometimes it will spawn, sometimes it doesn't. Remember, it is different for everyone, so if it doesn't spawn for you, go check the other caves. However, there should be a chest here that does spawn as well. But for starters, um, you do need shadow keep to spawn in the nightmare. As you guys see, I went on a Steam account that had no shadow keep. So essentially you do need shadow keep to spawn the nightmare. However, you don't need shadow keep to farm this chest right here. So if we look at the pattern, shoot the wrong one, boom. And do this over and over and over is over and literally do it for as long as you want. Now, obviously guys, before you go on hectic, this isn't an exotic farm. Um, Exotics can drop here. It's a, it's a very small chance, but you can't blow it up a portion and say it's not possible. Um, you can farm this for however as long as you want. However, if you guys want a real method that is going to work the best, I would suggest going to orbit for starters. Head over to orbit because you, you don't want to be doing this, you know, while trying to farm other things. So for starters, head to orbit. Now, open your browser, in this case for me. I would go to Google and search light, uh, light that you um, not from here. You're going to see the last sector today is chest plate. Also, if you haven't been to Zerk, go pick up this roll chase. It's a really nice roll, but yeah, it is the scavengers den EDZ. This is a really easy lost sector to do. So if you guys go to the EDZ and go do this lost sector right here, scavengers den, this is a super easy lost sector to do. It is under like literally four minutes. Um, if you know what you're doing and guys, I'm not a noob. Trust me um, If you don't know the situation, I've got locked in my steam account. So, you know, I kind of had to play on a different steam account, but yeah um, another great way that I like to farm exotics is Overall just playing the game. I mean These farm videos are good at some points, but dude most of these you get from the season pass literally Exotics I get a free exotic here. No, I didn't buy the season pass on the steam account So if I was to buy it, I'd get one exotic Two exotics, three exotics, four exotics, five, six, seven. I get like nine or so exotics, not counting that first page. But yeah, if you guys enjoyed today's video, hit that like button, sub, have a great day, peace.